Hey, what is up guys, it's HD Gadget. I've touched on this topic before with my LED video, but I'm gonna bring you guys another one and also show you how to install these. Okay, so I'm just gonna take my tiny little unboxing knife here. So in this box is a five meter strip of LEDs um, with a sticky back to it, so you can stick them on any surface. As soon as we open up the box, you'll see our massive remote. You can set your own settings and stuff which I think is pretty cool. So that is the controller, guys. Okay, so next in the box we have our control box. So this is basically, it picks up the signals coming from the remote and outputs the power, which you plug in there, through to the LEDs, which you plug into this bit here. And there's also an IR receiver on the top here um, to pick up the signal from the remote. Okay, so next in the box we have our power cable and then we have a few instructions which we don't need and then we have the LEDs in themselves. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and open up this packet here. So I'm now gonna go ahead and install this and take you guys along the process of installing. Okay guys, so before you do anything, I recommend that you go and plug it in just to make sure everything's working. Okay, so when you do this, you need to make sure that both the arrows in both cables are clipped together. So these two arrows are pointing the same way. If you do it the other way, it will not work. So it looks like a Christmas tree now on my desk. I feel like I bring joy to the world. So without breaking these, I'm just going to wrap them around my body to provide entertainment. I feel like a robot. So yes guys, thank you so much for watching this video. This is how you install your LEDs in your room. As you can see, they change the atmosphere of the whole room. And if you want to just change the colour, just use the massive remote here and just select a colour. Oh, this is like... Yes, this looks cooler. Wow, yes. Yes. This is so being the thumbnail of this video. Maybe a bit more. That's good. Okay. Okay, so don't go crazy unpeeling that adhesive off the back because if you need to fit it through like a hole or something and it's sticky, it's just gonna stick. My plan here is to go round my desk and then come up and go round this monitor here and then light up the wall and underneath the desk with one five meter strip of LEDs. Okay guys, so now it's a few days later and I've managed to stick them all in and I had a cracking idea while I was doing it. Why not go round the monitor to make it reflect on this wall here and also go behind the speakers um, which reflects against the wall behind it as well as underneath the desk as you can see down here. So these LEDs are looking so sick. I'll just give you guys a little example without them. My life has no meaning. They're looking insane on my setup here. Okay, so moving 
to the side, you can check out my handiwork here. It doesn't look like the most beautiful thing in the world. It's not really that good, if I'm honest. Underneath the desk, you can see where they pop up to go round the sides. Okay, so this is the remote control and so basically you've got your power switch here, stuff to speed up the lights and then you've got things where you can increase the brightness and then you've got this pad here where you can change the colour of the lights so we've got all loads of different colours and then around here we have other presets and combinations such as fading which looks awesome and then we've also got DIY colours so you can just press on one and then you can change how much red's there so you can see now the picture's changing it's got a lot more red in it and you could maybe I don't know maybe you don't want so much blue so you turn down the blue and then you've got a nice red colour here maybe you want a bit more green and it comes to a much warmer colour so you could set one of these DIY things maybe for gaming so you might choose to have your setup in a slightly different colour to improve your gaming experience maybe you quite like green for gaming um, but if you're like making videos or doing some other type of productivity on your desk you might want to choose a different colour, I don't know, blue, blue looks pretty nice. If you've seen my last LED video you would have seen the last controller which is only about that big. It doesn't give you a lot of customization with your lights um, but if you buy one of these it, it kind of works with my old ones. If I just show you here, these are my old LEDs and then if we, we can we can change the colours sometimes. There we go. So you can still change the colours with just one remote and set it to like fade and stuff. I just leave it on fade because I think fade is just the best thing. Anyway guys, so I'll be leaving links in the description for where you can buy your own LEDs and I will also leave links so that you can follow me on Instagram and go and check out my vlogging channel for more stuff from me. And so yes guys, thank you very much for watching this video. I'm not going to force you to do anything, but if you want to press the like button, then go ahead. The, the like button's down here. See you in my next video. Later.